Well, I thought being on the Utilities Commission was an honor, and of course it wasn't an elected uh, uh, position, but it was kind of like a training ground, or a lot of people came from city from the Utilities Commission would run for city council, and, and that was somewhat of an ambition I had, see if I liked it or not. And one of the first tasks that I had was to uh, 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 monitor the situation with Floyd. And of course we had the horrible flood and, and it was just horrific for this whole community. And we, uh, uh, one of our mission was keeping our water plant open. And so we launched a little small 16 foot aluminum uh, boat uh, from the bridge. I mean, if you go to the bridge today on Highway 11 uh, and see how far it is above uh, the Tar River, you, you'll be surprised. We actually put the boat in from that level. Got in, myself, uh, uh, Lorraine Chin, and uh, the mayor at the time was Nancy Jenkins, and none of us were small, and the fireman that was handling the boat wasn't small, and, and we rode down the river to the water plant, and the gunnels, if you've been on a, in boats before, the water was about that far away from being in our boat, and I thought, this is the dumbest thing we've ever done in our lives, to have way too much weight in these little boats. We saw dead animals come by, all kind of debris, I mean there were hogs, uh, cows floating by and if, you, if we had turned the boat over there was nowhere we could go. There was no land, I mean there was, it was all water. And so we got to the water plant and uh, it was probably one of the biggest miracles that, that Greenville has ever pulled off. I can remember Randy Emery, who, bless his soul, has passed on that was with Green Utilities forever. He was out there in a t-shirt sweating so many of the staff volunteered and prison labor came in and saved the day for us putting sandbags up around the water plant. If that plant had flooded, Greenville would have been in, in really, really bad shape. 